Now then YouTube, I'm the Tough Man and welcome to the first in a, a little mini-series, it's only a tiny little thing that's going on, maybe about four episodes or something like that, Not nothing huge. It is FIFA Revisited, G guys, 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 if you are one of my long-term subscribers, you will recognise this screen as FIFA 12 and you will also recognise this team as Crawley Town. Um, I did actually start a new season off-camera. You guys didn't see any of that. Um, I was wondering if I could actually see that somewhere of who I sold at the time, but I can't remember. Um, let me see if that, yeah, it should be in here. Unsuccessful, successful negotiations. Okay, so I bought some players and I sold one particular player who I wish I never bothered selling, and that was Sigurd Arsene. Um, I really wish I kept hold of him just for the purposes of this kind of video. But I did buy Berisha, I bought Leandro, and I bought Felipe Suto as well. Um, the transfer offer was received, Felipe Lopez, it expires in six days. I've, I don't know if I've said yes or no to that, I can't remember. Either which way, um, I... Well, let's get on with it. I'm going to do a couple of games, guys. I'm going to do this one against Wigan, and then one against the Knotts Forest. It's on World Class, it is on default sliders, 50-50 sliders um, just for a couple of games I really I wanted to get back into this guys and show you the Crawley Town the one that really started my channel off I did the World Cup but you know you can only do so much with the World Cup the Crawley Town really it was my best series and it was it lasted for 40 uh, no it lasted for 480 odd episodes um, de decline our offer for Felipe Lopez oh okay I don't know what I did there, but apparently I've done it. Uh, so, yeah, I, I really wanted to get back into this and show you guys, the new subscribers, what my Crawley Town team is like. It's a very good team. Um, it still could be better in other areas, which is why I've bought these other players and so on and so forth. But, uh, oh, God, indigestion. But, oh, man, look at how long it takes to get to fucking... The simulation here. Come on, man. I do want to play at some point this year. I think I was after Courtois, actually. Was I after Courtois? I can't remember if I was after Courtois. I really can't remember. This was a long time ago when I actually picked up the Crawley uh, playthrough. But uh, here we go. I'm going to go ahead and uh, sort the team out when I'm in the match. I may as well. Oh, man. I haven't played this for a while. Some of the new, uh, the new features... Of FIFA won't be involved. Look at that beast. Beast of a man. As you can see, world class. Chris Mumple, six minutes just dry. Let's go to the game settings so you can see I'm not taking the piss. Everything is 50 50. Six minutes, world class. All that bullshit. And uh, let's go to the team. And people will recognize. Body People will recognize that guy. And if you don't recognize that, that, recognize that guy, you need some slappings. You seriously need some slappings. Oh, apparently, uh, Kinect is going to be playing this match, though. What? Nielsen. What an amazing guy this is. I'm not fucking shitting you. This guy is immense. He's fast as fuck. But look at his strength. He's massively strong as well. It's amazing, this guy. Absolutely amazing. 75 overall. Really doesn't do him justice at all. Really does not do him justice. Kinect, of course, is massively fast. Uh, just can't finish for bag of shit, really. Which is why it's crap. 65. Um, right, let's have a look at the uh, the thing. Pedro Tavero, Martis, Kaneki. Have a serious... Where's my guys? Where's Bozza? Bozza, why are you not in Bozza? Bozza, -dee. And, of course, Leandro. Yeah, they're all, like, fully fit. It's probably because the uh, class is centre-forwards. Uh, so, central attack in mid. I used to have Discarud. And for old times' sake, I'm going to put him in. Left mid, it used to be either Dayton or Nolito. Now I'm going to put Nolito in because, uh, you know, old times. Carmona, of course, sent a defensive mid until I bought the uh, the most recent guy, which was... Where are you? Felipe Suto, who's uh, better than Carmona. But for old times, we're going to stick him in. Shimanga, win. I mean, still, look at that. Felipe Lopez, actually. I used to use him a lot, I'm sure. Uh, Toivio, Hovland in there. Yeah, we'll use Hovland. And, of course, Vito Francesco. I believe, yeah, I'm going to say, I believe I got Nathaniel Klein in that last season. 
And I don't think I've got anybody to... Uh... Oh yeah, Guaita. Of course I did. Of course I did. So that's the team that's going to be uh, going to be doing in today's episode. Like I said, I'm going to do a couple of episodes with Crawley. And I think I'm going to do, uh, you know, a revisited with uh, York City as well. A couple of episodes with York. So, uh, even though it was only last year though, so I'm not sure if I want to do that or not. But, oh well. Be worth a crack. Away from home against Wigan. Let's see what kind of bullshit that I can point out in uh, in these. There'll be no overhead clearances, that's for sure. No overhead clearances. None of that shit in this one. Oh man, I'm looking forward to this. It's been a long time since I stepped out with these guys. Felipe Lopez, a boosh. There's none of that, you know, shot bullshit either. It's old style. Old style-y. All of this came to an end when we won the Champions League against uh, Real Madrid. Hi there, I'm Martin Tyler. With me today, Alan Smith. And so here we go. A match from the We're Premier off. For you. Yep, thanks, Back Martin. again Martin. with Crawley Town. This is going to be interesting. Since I haven't played uh, FIFA 12 since, well, since last time I played FIFA 12, which was when I played against... Uh, well, I played as Crawley, but I can't remember who it was against. Bonnie. Nee. It's done him a beaut. Bozer! Oh. Bonnie. Nee. Oh, tried to grab his tip. Melito. Oh, I can do my crosses in this as well. What the hell? It's not without its pros, bro. It's not without its pros. But there's none of this. Look, they're not like right on my crack. World class, and they're not right on my crack. That's a good ball. That, unfortunately, I think it might just run. No, it won't. Yes, it will. And Boz is like, oh, shit. What happened to him there? Funny I remember all the buttons. He sort of fell over and broke everything, every bone in his body. I don't think you can see it, though. Yeah, it seemed to... Oh, no, it, it looked worse from that other angle. This is going to be a bit of fun, guys. There's absolutely, even if I lose, I don't give a flying fuck because this is not my playthrough anymore. You know, I'm just uh, revisiting this for a bit of fun. Nice idea with the through ball. Didn't come off, though. I wonder if Borini is going to score. It's been a while. Been a while. Nolito. Shimanga, Nolito again, Carmona, who scored a fucking brilliant goal against Man United, I can tell you that much. If you haven't seen that, just have a look around, right just have a look at my games, Crawley Town versus Man United, and eventually you'll come across one. And we've got news from other matches being played today. It was an absolutely fantastic goal from Carmona, one of the best goals I've scored ever in, uh, in the history of FIFA's. That's a great chance. Shimanga. That's it, Discarud. Good lad. Oh, it wasn't a great ball that towards Bozza. He's not going to win it back. But he is. Bozza. It's underneath it. Oh, I thought he'd nicked it there, but he hasn't. Martin Kelly. And we can have a check on some other Martin Kelly plays in. for fucking uh, Wigan in this. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Bozza, already on his way towards that, you see. I never give this game enough credit, you know. Boosh! Oh, come on, is that it again? What a legend that guy is. Honestly, fucking love this team. I love this team with a passion. Absolutely love this team. I built this team. No fucking uh, you know, board takeover or anything like that. I built this fucking team and I know it inside fucking out. What a team. I love this fucking team. Four and a half star Crawley Town. Bullshit ref. He's going to aim for the magic gap and attended to do this in 5th 12. And when I bring uh, what's his face on at half time, you watch. Go on, boy. Go on, Leroy. Oh, no. When I went, went up, 
he was pressing the circle, well not the circle, when I was pressing the B button he was meant to just pull him, pull him out of the way. I don't know even if you can do that in this one. <laughs> it's been that long since I played it, I don't know if you can press B to pull them back. They're a very strong team, I've got to say. Physical, very physical team, my team. Lovely stuff. That's what I like to see. Quick counter as well. Go, 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 go. Oh, too close to that guy. Sit, just stay back. It's fine. It's fine. They're passing it well here. Oh, lovely. I actually think, you know, playing this, it might be because my team's a lot better actually on this than it is in uh, FIFA 14, but I actually think this is a lot better. There we are, Nathaniel Klein going on his usual run, whipping in. You still don't win headers though on FIFA 12. That's one thing, you never win headers on FIFA 12. George! Was that a block? It was a block. It was a magic bastard. And I can do my good old whippy gin. Oh, Do win headers, you see. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think, you know, playing it at the time, FIFA 12, I don't think I gave it enough credit. FIFA 14 is insanely hard compared with uh, FIFA 12 and its, and its predecessor, FIFA 13. I think it's the, uh, you know, because these guys just stand off you. You know, they don't, like, hassle you all, like, fucking for about 17 years. They don't immediately try to get you. They allow you time to think. They allow you time to move. And your other players actually move in more, in more of an intelligent fashion. Now, it might be, like I said, it might be just because I'm playing as, like, a higher-rated team. And it could be like that in... Uh, I can't get in front of this guy here. There we are. It might be because I'm a higher rated team. And it might just feel a lot better because I'm not just not used to it. Oh, there we go. Look, go on, Leandro. It's good ball in towards Borini. Hey, come off the keeper's note. Come off the keeper's note. Leroy George, whippage in. Discruds trying to get underneath. I don't know what he's playing at. Oh, shit. Oh, that was lucky. You're not going to beat Shimanga. He's fucking well fast. You ain't going to beat Shimanga. Don't think you're even going to beat Guaita, so I won't fucking worry about it. Ah! Oh. Go on, Leroy. Yeah, you can press B to drag him back. I had to, I had to figure it out. Hey! Pick it up, then, boy. I think this was the first uh, FIFA that you can actually do one of the quick throw. Is he offside? He's not. He's managed to stay on. Leandro goes for the shot. It's a pretty shit shot, really. It was with his left foot. I think he's right footed. Body deep! I haven't scored with him yet. Yet. Very, very familiar team. The only person that's missing is, uh, uh, um, what's his first? Sigurd Arsen. That's it. Go on, lad. Turn. That's it. Go on, Nolito. Oh. Magic bastard. Just trying to uh, cover these gaps. Half time. The score is 1 0 thanks to a Carmo and a Bush. In the 18th minute as well. It's a fantastic effort. Look at that. Who the fuck does that? You mental man. Look at that. Carmo and doing his usual run. And then doing the usual smack. And then the usual go. 1 0 so far. Starting this second half. Oh, that was not where I was aiming. Go on, Discarud. That's what I'm talking about. 
Here's the cross. Where are you, come on? He was meant to be there, boy. Or was it Discarud who was meant to be there, but he was well out of position. I don't know. I don't know if it's me. I don't know if I've improved since I've played, uh, been playing FIFA or what, but... Uh, Oh, it just so happens. I was there for that, guys. Jermaine Deefe always fucking scores against me, but it just so happens I do get a touch to it, but it just puts it straight in the path of Jermaine Deefe. Scores one all. That's a shame, that. The first shot practically on target. So, same shit, different game. Oh, Barini, what are you doing? You've got a more powerful shot than that. No, you have. I've got to remember that finesse shots are better in this game. Yeah, I wanted to pass to him. <laughs> Past that. Did he? I knew that was coming. Here's the cross. The defender has dealt with the cross well. Ugh. Defending slightly lucky defending. Bit dodgy that was. Go on, Bozza. Oh, what are you doing? He's kept it in, though. Oh, and then he's given it away. <laughs> awesome. Go on, Leroy. Or not, as the case may be. Well, we did start off all right, but I don't know what's going on. I think, you know, we're going to come out fighting, I think, the second half. Past it. What the flying foot? Tackle in that position. Trying to keep the ball here, but they haven't been able to do so. Hey, not having that. Nathaniel Klein. Belito. Camona. Oh, there's no way you could read that. Now, a chance to pass the ball around and play some football of their own. That was a lovely challenge. It needed to be done as well. That challenge needed to be done, otherwise that guy was in behind me. That was not a well passed to. Oh, no, 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 no. Run, boys, run! That was a foul. Well executed. Watson. Oh, referee. He did the same to me not so long back. Play that. Slaps. 75th minute, I think it's about time, you know. Some team management. Match which is level in I think zone. Nielsen. It's time for Nielsen to come off. Uh, to come on, sorry. Not off. And Nelito to come on as well. Gets his foot up high Great to deal with the bouncing ball to shoot. Go on, Neroy George. A great ball. Oh, what the hell was that? That was meant to be one of those little heel chop things, but he just never did it. Right, me, uh, me subs are going to come on. Me tall, strong guy. Leandro Whippage Nielsen's there already. Oh, 
I thought the first touch would have had it there. That was an interception. Dayton. Really worked for his team. Discarud. I don't know. What's he playing at? Come on, Nielsen. Show what you're made of, boy. Mind you, he's probably going to be playing the next match, so I won't worry if you don't get to see him too much. Him and uh, him and Kaneki, I think, will be playing the next match. Oh, thought the move was there then. We're coming to the closing stages now, and a game that's still keeping us on the edge of our seats. What are they doing now, Alan? With the but um, unfortunately, this does have bullshit time involved with it as well. So you got to remember that. Look at Nielsen go up. Nielsen, that should have been in. Should have been in. And where's Carmona when you need him? I've got attacking. I've got attacking on, and the guy's just sat there in midfield. Play two, Jermaine Defoe. Ah, shit. What a chance. They've nicked it back. Chance is here. Of course he's nicked it back. Bullshit time. That's a good pass. Good defending. Go on, Nielsen. Run, boy. You just let him straight past you there. There's no excuse for that. Stephen Anzonzi. Well, it's not the right person, but never mind. Oh, Nielsen was through there as well, I reckon. Well, it was a one-all draw for the first game back with Crawley Town. And to say I haven't played FIFA 12 for, well, years... It's, uh, I don't think that was a bad game. I think that was a very good game. The one chance that, uh, of course, Wigan have, they go and fucking score. It's the same shit as always. And you're never going to get away from that. And it just seems that, you know, they don't have many chances do the computer. And if they have one fucking chance, look at that. One shot was on target and they scored that one fucking chance. It's, all, it's been the same in FIFA for a long time. I just wish that, uh, you know, the opposition can have... Uh, as many chances as I do, you know, I had nine shots, three on target. I wish that in FIFA, the computer can have nine shots, three on target, but I just wish that they got the same result as what I did. But either which way, 55% possession, absolutely in control of that. To lose it, really, to their only one shot on target, well, a bit annoying. But until next time, guys, I've been the tough man. Thanks very much for watching. If you've liked this video, please do give it a like. It helps my channel, and it also helps, well, FIFA in general on my channel. Because that's all I'm doing right now is uh, football on this channel. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. And uh, stay tuned for part two, which will be coming out in the next couple of days. So until then, I've been the top man as always. Stay safe.